Have a look at the first scene where there is a chair with a red cloth over it and is placed in mid-sea over a stone. Here the Kretos arrives, let's see what he says. You are certain you remember nothing of this place? Oh, nothing that would help us. That's Mimia. Master thyself. There is a door above which something is written, so only one person can read that, you know who he is. Of course Atreus, so Kretos might meet Atreus in this DLC. Also there is a statue of Valkyrie above, so we will meet many new Valkyries during gameplay. As soon as Kretos enters the gate, it looks like he is pulled into the light. In this scene, Kretos is walking towards a golden chest. Now you can see this chest and a door to travel between realms. Now look at these flying stones, it means there is no gravity, let me know in comments if you know this realm. Must face this. Now this is a new flying creature attacking on Kretos, so we will have to defeat many of these during the game. Now the Kretos suddenly wakes up like he was dreaming something bad. Let's go again. In this scene, we can see Kretos using his blades, axe and Draupnir spear too. Now notice this golden broken structure behind this fight. Also there is a big chain, that might hold something big. Here also you can see the same golden structure and flying stones too. And the last one this boss. He is similar to a boss in God of War 2. That's all for today. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe for upcoming God of War Valhalla videos. Goodbye.